My restaurant opens in six weeks, and I'm making sure I get every detail right. This is the hardest I've worked on anything since... Wow, I've never worked hard on anything. What a cool life. Looks like everything's on track for July. It's just too bad we're not opening in time for this Unity concert. The extra publicity would have given us a nice boost. Why don't we? We could do a soft opening tomorrow and be ready just in time for the concert crowd. Do you really think you can pull that off? Well, nobody can predict the future except me. I guarantee it'll work, and in six months, this place will be bigger than McDonald's. As always, I love your enthusiasm. See you tomorrow, partner. A soft opening tomorrow? From now on, everyone call me Kristen because I am wigging out right now. Yeah, we're not even close to being ready. They're not even done painting that sign. It says Tom's bye. Actually, no, that's good. We're ready. Mitch is right. The amount of buzz we get from opening next weekend is too big to pass up. We can do it. This little Italian restaurant will put McDonald's out of business on three. One, two, three. I this little Italian restaurant will be bigger than McDonald's. Hell fire. We have 10 tables booked for the soft opening. It's all friends and family, so hopefully they'll go easy on us. How's it looking, Ron? Maybe uh, speed it up a little? This is not government work. As such, I treat it with care and attention. OK, but also, go faster. I haven't had time to hire staff yet, so April, you'll handle service. No, can't I just stay in the back and spit in people's food like we planned? <laughs> Ugh, the sawdust from Ron's chairs is everywhere. My sinuses are on the fritz and smell is 90% of taste, maybe 95. Okay, Craig, Donna's gonna be your wine taster. You guys will work as a team. Fine, but if he raises his voice once, once, I'm out. Please don't stick to that policy. I got the menus. Great. <laughs> Larry, what the hell? What are these pictures? Oh, geez. I must have given the printer the wrong flash drive. What is this, a rotten grapefruit? No, it's my dog's rectum. Lord Shelton has a growth, so we're sending pictures over to the vet. But I guess this isn't good for menus, is it? Larry? 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 Listen to me. This is the worst thing you've ever done. I need you to take all of these dog butt pictures and burn them in the pizza oven. April, you list all the menu items from memory. It'll be classier anyway. Ron, what was wrong with that one? It was too perfect. It looked machine made. It's a bold flavor, fruity. A little earthy. Well, which is it, fruity or earthy? It can't be both. They're mutually exclusive. Oh, no. You do not come at me like that. I'm sorry. I don't know who I am anymore. A man without a palate isn't a man. I love you, Donna. Oh. What are you guys doing? There's people waiting out there. We're having a moment, you monster. <sighs> Stop hassling me. Ron, you're amazing. You've always been like a grandpa to me. But can you please lower your standards a tiny bit so my customers have somewhere to sit? No. Oh. I am so sorry, Tom. I can't believe I'm saying this, but don't worry about it. Restaurant superstition, breaking a glass on the first night is good luck. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh, jeez. Seems like things are a little chaotic. No, no, everything is perfect. This is April. She's going to be taking care of you tonight. Hello, welcome to Tom's Bistro. Today we have spaghetti, linguine, fettuccine, ravioli, rigatoni, bucatini, lasagna. Could you repeat that? Spaghetti, linguine, fettuccine, ravioli, rigatoni, Ferrari, Lamborghini, bucatini, lasagna. Uh, can I see a menu? We had to throw our menus away because they are covered with pictures of Larry's dog's rectum. Great news. Lord Sheldon's gonna make it. <laughs> yeah, we just have to apply a salve to his anus every hour for the rest of his life, but... <laughs> oh, enjoy your meal. Crying out loud. No, Mitch, don't leave. Come on. You have no idea how to run a restaurant. I've been in this game before, and I can see the cracks starting to form. Sorry, kid. Consider my investment terminated. Uh, D, let's go. Sir, were you sitting in that chair? Yes, yes, I was. Why? No reason. Let's go. 